Good afternoon. I hope everyone's having a good day. This is uh, pertaining to, partly pertaining to the previous video I made pertaining to the burning center uh, threat. Uh, after sending that, I was reminded that, uh, according to news, uh, that, that there have been incidents in India of, of pretty ladies suffering what is termed gallery burnings, and I think that it's terrible. And I'm always, wherever they're from, I'm always for the nice lady, pretty ladies being safe and stiff. Uh, about the, uh, the particular lady's comment, if she was really conspiring being, being with burning conspiracy, I would have only hoped that she'd be uh, caught, uh, caught and stuck and uh, prosecuted appropriately. I think burning is terrible, and I wouldn't have ever thought of burning. I've included a, uh, uh, an edited report from uh, July of uh, 2013 to accompany this. Uh, I just hope that there aren't any burnings in it. But of course, the uh, the uh, that the particular subject reminded me of another subject that there had been written about the uh, big incinerators that were built to destroy chemical weapons. One of them being located in an area of Utah and uh, Star Valley. Uh, right near there, there's a uh, Indian reservation of some kind, and uh, uh, the particular place, Tool, uh, was sometimes being pronounced as Tuella. And it worried me because uh, there was a place in the Denver area that I hadn't been back to, although I was only wanting to be nice to the ladies. Uh, there had been a little bit of an embarrassment, but I had only meant to be nice. But unfortunately, uh, uh, there were some persons of the uh, old uh, uh, secret gay uh, stain accusation malpractice from when I was in Orlando, 25-year-old, that was secretly stalking me through life, and their attitudes were accusing that I had done something particularly nasty and that I had been embarrassed about it and wanted to leave and never be with ladies again, but they were exactly wrong. So anyway, it was alleged that uh, that the uh, malicious kind of act, uh, activity following me had been involved with getting the uh, uh, Cinderella City Mall eventually uh, closed after I moved away from the Denver area. And uh, the uh, the report accompanying this uh, explains how the possibility there, there's a possibility that some buried the, the name Tool to pronounce it Tuella because they were wanting to make some kind of a judgment that it, uh, wanted to include the name uh, Cinderella. Well, uh, uh, there might be a clue in a kind of sexy song, as a matter of fact. I think the lyrics were Cinderella, 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 I just loved it so well. Well, anyway, another worry. Uh, in the report that I've uh, included in this was a, a man insisting that he's the creepy former stepfather, Bill Love, getting into the sound of an approaching uh, airliner uh, saying a threat of roasting up in cinders. So anyway, the, one of the, he's one of the perpetrators and he's definitely known and I'm just hoping that everyone's safe and still. Uh, the, I always just nicely care about the pretty ladies and any any, uh, uh, you know, any misdemeanor or misunderstanding of the past was only a matter of wanting to uh, be uh, nice and uh, being pressured a lot by the uh, law of disruption. It was forcing me to always be alone. You know, there was a little bit of hanky-panky, and actually there had been some really nice and, and uh, very uh, uh, enticing encouragement by pretty ladies back then. And I was sorry about the few misunderstandings. Again, uh, this always for uh, the various nice ladies being safe, and I hope that any uh, threat of burning people is uh, prevented. And uh, again, I hope everyone's going to have a good and safe and fun Fourth of July weekend.